What's going on, beautiful people? Welcome to We Teach AI Designs. And in this video, we want to go ahead and react to something we saw online. Been seeing it all, all across social media, Twitter, Facebook, all that good stuff. It's the Bashinga, the first Black Panther uh, trailer, but it's all using AI art images. So let's go ahead and check this out. I like that design. Like, let's let's go back. Like that whole that whole scene. First look, it's dope because he's adding text to the actual images. And um, if you know how to do things uh horizontally, I have a video on that to be able to uh dash dash ar three two to be able to make sure uh, your images are horizontal. So this is super dope. I like the design. Now this is super cool to me because you know many times you see the uh uh image just by itself but rarely do you see like uh, other figures behind it you know so being able to have those different layers it's a whole crowd back there i think this is like super dope <laughs> Again, you know, you have the main central figure, and then you have so many different uh, elements behind it. That's that's fully fully figured. I could see, you know, notice the little flaws or whatever, like on a, you know, his face or whatever looks off. But right, the center image or whatever is super dope. So I think this is this is incredible. This is fire. I think this is Bashinga right here. It looks like uh, the Black Panther, you know, garb is kind of like in some god dang um, Victorian era type of, you know, armor and it, they're throwing flames or they're on fire and they're just, you know, red in the eyes. I think the design here is really cool. Kind of got the black and gold uh, Killmonger type of design here. Um, super cool. This is fresh. This is fresh. I got to pause this. This is fresh. The fact that he, uh, you know, put everybody on the ships and, you know, they're kind of selling, going to their destination. I think this is dope. It's super dope detail and design. So this is Fastos, Brian Tyree Henry's character um, inside the Internals. So, you know, as, as you know, he's lived all the way from the beginning of time all the way to, you know, where we are now. So it would make sense that he would be a part of the, um, you know, it seems like creating a technology for the original uh, Black Panther. Uh, he would have lived in that time, Fastos. I think that's super dope, dope detail. John Boyega's character, I think, you know, him as Bashinga, as the original Black Panther, I think that's super uh, dope casting that he did. And as you see, um, you know, he uploaded an image of um, of uh, the uh, uh, John Boyega and was able to kind of get his facial features or John Boyega is a pretty popular name on the Internet. So I'm pretty sure he probably didn't even have to upload an image. He probably just typed in John Boyega. <laughs> Now, this is like so dope. This is probably like the dopest shot because, again, you know, you have like the full element of the scene. It's not just the person, but you see the people um, in the background and stuff like that. And while some of the details are a little, little wonky, you get the you get the idea, you get the get the concept behind it. Wow. Bravo. Bravo, man. All right. Dope trailer. And I just want you guys to understand this is also things that you and I can create as well. You know, we have videos on how to make the images landscape. You know, he used some of the images, excuse me, the music from the uh, Black Panther soundtrack. And all he did scene by scene was simply just give you a visual 
of a concept trailer. You know, it wasn't nothing too crazy. And if I'm not mistaken, it got like millions of views. And this is all stuff that we could create ourselves. So I'm going to go into um, probably making some trailers myself just to kind of show you guys how easy it really is. Um, we have a lot of extra dope tools that we could use and we could get into. Um, but yeah, man, I think that trailer was super fire. Uh, Shouts out to them um, just to come up with the original concept and design. The design uh, tools that they use was incredible in terms of not just having the person in the foreground, but the people in the background. I thought it was super dope, man. So props to the creator of that video. I'm going to link it right here in the description so that way you could go back and watch it anytime you want to and all that good stuff. But if there's anything else that you guys want me to react to, make sure you send, send the information to me. Leave a comment below. Make sure you like the video, subscribe, all that good stuff. Until next time, y'all. Peace.